Rob Jackson with Fansroid.com. I'm here at the Huawei booth at uh, MWC 2012, looking at the Huawei Ascend D Quad. Um, it's called the D Quad because it's got four cores. Um, it's this the, with the NVIDIA, NVIDIA uh, Tegra 3 processor. So, um, in addition to running that quad core, it's also got Android 4.0. So that's a pretty awesome combination. They're calling it the world's fastest phone. Um, I guess what fast means is depends on your opinion, but that's how they're marketing it. And with a uh, quad-core processor and Android 4.0, I'm not going to argue. Um, but let's take a quick look around the phone uh, itself. You've got a 4.5-inch screen with 1280 by 720 pixel resolution. On the bottom here, you can see the back, home, and menu keys, which are, uh, you can see there they go, illuminated. Um, up here, you can see there's a uh, status indicator light and a front-facing camera. On the top, we've got a 3.5 millimeter headset jack along with the power button. On the right-hand side, we've got the volume rocker. It's a little hard to see with, uh, with the lighting, but the volume rocker. Nothing on the bottom. Uh, the USB, micro USB port on the, on the left. Um, and on the back, we've got a, what camera is this? An 8 megapixel camera uh, with dual LED flash. The front facing camera is actually a uh, 1.3 megapixel camera. Um, this phone is really slim actually for what's packed in it. Uh, it's only 8.9 millimeters thick, which is great, and it's got an 1800 milliamp battery, um, which is a pretty big battery considering the quad core and how thin uh, this device is. So. Um, since let me just take you it's in a different language so it's not in English it's a little bit difficult to show you some of the apps and other features on here but as you can see right here running Android 4.0.3 um, I'm pretty eager to test this a little more and see exactly how fast it is and if their uh, claim to be the fastest smartphone really holds true um, so pricing availability and uh, all the specs you can find in our post about this on fansroid.com. This is Rob Jackson signing out, Mobile World Congress.